another battle of undefeated Southwest Virginia Powers narrows, hangs their hat on defense. Galax always has been a high octane offense. The two 7 0 teams collide tonight. Let's get you out and have a look. And I want to remind you, Galax has the big lead as we pick it up here. Maroon Tide making their way to the end zone again. This time, Denver Brown for the scramble, breaking tackles and the first down. Later, Cole Pickett, the keeper. About the one yard line, we've got a fall ball on the play. Green wave get on it and hold him out of the end zone. Narrows can't convert. Still third quarter. Maroon tied ball. Pickett launching it down the field. Picked off by Logan Green, who takes it past the 40. Narrows played admirably tonight on defense, but the early 21 0 Galax lead held up. That is your final. Here's our Brook Leonard with more. The Region 1C title going to the Galax Maroon Tide after an early 21-0 lead. Head coach Shane Allen said it was the disruptive defense the Tide played in the second half that sealed the win. Our guys come in and, 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 and embrace physicality and practice every 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 week. So, you know, we knew it was going to be a, a – I, I thought it would be a really low-scoring game. I mean, I, you know, I know they're really good off and they're really big. and But, I, you know, I knew our guys would step up. And it, I thought it would be, you know, a, a 6 nothing, 7 nothing ball game, you know, something like that. So I knew it was going to be a great defensive game between two great defensive teams. So the road doesn't quite end here for Galax. They'll travel to Holston next week for the Class 2 state semifinals. In Galax, I'm Brooke Leonard. Back to you. Thanks, Brooke. And actually, Holston advanced after J.I. Burton cancels due to COVID-19. Quick check of that Class 1 bracket, and you will see they'll be hosting Galax next week. West Point will host Riverheads.